What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. It is another AFK journey video and in this one we are going to be talking about arena. Not the uh, free to play arena, the, uh, the the main arena where we do get our rewards and we will go over like because I haven't covered arena at all okay. So it may be a little bit lengthy but hopefully not too lengthy. I don't want to do it too lengthy. Um, we do get a lot of rewards from arena okay and if you're spending a bit your aim is to be in the top 20 champion each week okay each week because the rewards are just so good uh you get the arena coins you're getting gold which at the moment isn't massive you're also getting a, tw a lot of twilight essence i say a lot five but you want to keep building this up okay on your account you're also getting 16 one hour experience glasses ignore the cosmetics the cosmetics are nice but you know uh but number one oh say one to five isn't much of an improvement you do get some more arena coins you get the same amount of experience you get one more twilight essence but you do get some extra little extra little incentives to sun crown there um the daily reward is also a bit more um you can see that the daily rewards also count a lot but if you look at 21 to 100 it drops down to 12 one hours 1700 arena coins for twilight essence so i say top 100 is probably the aim for the majority okay the majority if you're at least spending a little bit um, and you won't feel bad about that then even like the top 200 it's not bad okay but i say it's not bad but it's not great either like it's a big difference and if you're starting out on a fresh server get to top five as fast as you can to get these first time rewards because these are very very good first time rewards so if you didn't you know push to that top five initially you're gonna you know you're gonna miss out on those rewards because it's gonna get harder and harder and harder on a server as time goes on to get that first time reward and getting that position so that's vital you do do that also you've got your victory rewards here that you should be doing every week getting 20 victories um now arena in any gacha game is all about who spends more okay but it's not only always about who spends more it's also about a little bit of luck on certain hero pools and it's also about placement of heroes it's also about using heroes to counter certain heroes now there isn't a huge amount of heroes in the game currently which actually works in our favor to learn the game and to you know to to progress with heroes that release over time let's see if we can find someone here to attack okay so we are going to target mojo and mojo i know you're in the guild I'm not targeting you on purpose. You just seem to have a t perfect, perfect kind of t I know you haven't got Eagle. We can talk about Rowan, okay? Because Rowan is a nightmare in PvP if you're letting him boost the energy of the enemy. Now, the way we can counter this is we do have an Eagle because he's going to counter the Valor, okay? So Valor will be trying to nuke and it won't be able to kill Igor. He'll be jumping around graves. So Val is going to be completely chasing Igor around and wasting a lot of time doing so. There is no Igor here, so we will use our Valor and it will be against Lucius, but, you know, that's okay. I'm actually going to teleport. Hmm. No, I know what we're going to do. We're actually going to take out uh, Valor and we're going to bring in Rhaenyra. Okay, and we're going to throw... We're going to bring the enemy's Rowan to our back line here because you can see this is a portal. We're going to remove his Rowan so he's not going to be boosting the energy. Pull him back to our side and we're going to put our Sasir over in the enemy side. Now, there are other heroes you can do this with. Yes, Sasir may not be the best option to do it with, but I'm not too fussed because Valor is going to be targeting Igor. Uh, Lucius isn't going to do a ton of damage and she should be okay. She should be okay. So let's have a little look here. So we do have Forearm. We do have Rowan. We do have Cecilia. We have Eagle to counter Valor. We have Rhaenyra countering Rowan by bringing him back. Also increasing damage against allies. Removing some allies with some CC. And putting Cecilia into his end. Let's have a look at how this works out. Because in theory, it works. You can see that Rowan's been pulled back. Stopping him from boosting the energy of the enemies. Lucius has been forced to move up the front here. Igor has just taken a hit from Valor. And he's safe, as you can see. He will leap back now to this grave. So Valor is made non-invoid. She is going to do nothing. Cecilia is just picking away at this other Cecilia over here. And the battle looks okay. The battle looks okay. Is Cecilia did... Or was that our one? That's our Mr. Carlisle. His Cecilia is yet to cast it. But you can see Igor is just eating up that Valor. We've just taken his forearm out of battle, I believe. Couldn't really see it. No, his forearm is still there. That would have been Lucius. 
Vala still chasing around Igor. And, you know, it's clearing up quite nicely. It's clearing up quite nicely. This is his final one. Four, I need to die now. So this is kind of a representation of how um, Igor can counter Vala. Um, Rainier can be huge against a team with Rowan in it. And also, you will see, hopefully, hopefully we can find... I'm not going to attack Finch. Finch will probably destroy me. Um, I don't even want to try that one yet. Uh, Xenohort. Well, in fact, I think Walesy might have an Igor. He does. Okay, perfect. So this is what we want. Now, again, we're not going to be using... Um, we will keep seeing here. We'll keep rowing. It's pretty much the same team. Pretty much the same team, but we're going to be using Odie instead of Igor now. Okay, the reason we're not using Igor, there isn't a Valor on the enemy team. So we're going to bring Odie in to destroy the enemy's Igor. Because as soon as that health bar goes below the poison rate, he will be instantly executed. He cannot leap around. Also, Rainier, again, we're going to be removing his Rowan over to our back line. Odie is going to jump in here. Probably targeting Cecilia actually first off, and then it'll be Igor. But we'll just see. We will see what happens, and Cecilia will help to clear up. There we go. Okay, so he is targeting Igor. Igor's dead. Igor's gone. That's how quick it is. And also, Odie will kill Cecilia before she gets a chance to get Mr. Carlisle off. She's dead. Uh, prisons are off. Is it actually... You know, quite a fast clear on this one. Lucius just survived the execution. So, Odie is huge against a team with um, with Igor in it. Just massive. Okay, so Odie, you need to, you know, really, really utilize that. If you have Rhaenyra, uh, it doesn't really matter what exclusive because you can still port around even at the base. Nassandra, no, rank three. Um... Again, an Eagle, Valor, Rowan, Cecilia, Foran. Okay, so we do want to still use Eagle. I'm going to remove Cecilia, bring in Odie, and see what this can do. We're also going to try and bring this Rowan back to us and move ours up. And let's see what this one does. Valor hopefully doesn't kill our Eagle fast enough. Let's have a look. We'll look, we'll leave it like this. So we've got that Rowan over our end. We've now got our Eagle actually killing the Valor. Valor's dead. Uh, we probably, yeah, Igor does survive, but we probably didn't even need to use Igor on our team for this one, actually. We probably could have used um, Cecilia, but Odie did just die. So that was a little close, and his Igor is now jumping around. That's a problem. It's not, uh, well, we should still win this, okay? But that's like, I could have, I feel like I could have prevented that. I don't feel like I needed to use my Igor. I could have left Cecilia in there, I believe. And that might have made it a little bit easier because this is, you know, depending on the uh, the rarity of an eagle, can make it, and it's just long. It's just long. Look at this. Look at this. It's long, and it's frustrating, and it's going to be close. We're going to lose. Are we going to lose? Surely not. Surely he's got a lot less graves. Is that his last one? That was his last one. Okay, and these are all of... Uh, uh, okay. Right. That happened. <laughs> that happened. We're going to try and find the Sandra again in a minute because we can now test. We can now test that. With Cecilia. Oh. All right, Xenohort, we've got to try you. We've got to try you. You haven't, you have Rhaenyra and Valor. We're going to remove our Odie. We're going to bring in a Valor. No, we're not. We're going to bring an Eagle. Throw him at the back. But I want to, I want to bring, goodness sake. I want this, ru okay, we've got him. But we're also going to create a link with Foran here with Cecilia. So that actually gives her a little bit more survivability, depending. And we're not... I don't believe we're losing anyone to the teleport of... Here's Rhaenyra. Let's find out. Let's see how this one plays out. Nope. Okay, we didn't. Good. So we do have his Rowan. He's not going to be boosting them. Okay. 
could come down to rarity. Mr. Carlisle was up in a really nice group of enemies up there. We've lost our Rainier. I think I think we're okay. Again, we said this on the last one. We lost. We lost. Don't forget, this is like, you know, the higher end players on the... Yeah, okay, we've lost again. We've lost. Imagine me calling this a guide and we've just lost two in a row. But that's how it goes. And I'm not, you know, you can't win them all. You've got to try and try and work this out. Someone's probably going to go, yeah, dude, if you just used this hero, then you wouldn't have lost that. My bad. Okay. We need to look for Nisandra. Where's Nisandra? Come on. Show yourself. I just want to switch. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Now, we're removing our eagle. We're going to bring in Cecilia. We're going to bring in Cecilia and hope that this Valor does not kill our Cecilia. And if it doesn't, then it should be a much better, much better face off. Yeah, she isn't going to get the ultimate in time. So we should be good. We should be, like, much, but yeah. Yeah, okay, and our OD didn't die either. Yeah, okay, so we wiped the floor with it this time. So we did very much counter it that time. Uh, compared to the first battle. Maybe we just got a little bit lucky in the RNG. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But using Rhaenyra is obviously huge in PvP. Um, who else? I don't want to target Nassandra again. I should because I get the points, but I'm not going to because oh, I want to try a different team. Hmm. Mojo. Did we attack Mojo already? I feel like we did. I feel like we attacked, but I'm sorry, but he was the last one to come across. Last one to come across. We need to bring Igor in here. And we need to take this Rowan. Yeah, okay, it should be fine. We already did this one, didn't we? Um, well, you know, if you if you missed it for whatever reason, you can watch it again. Bringing his Rowan over. We're switching our OD over to the other end so he can take out the DPS at the back. Our oh, Eagle is countering his Valor. That kind of thing going on. It's a little bit of a mouthful, but we do get through it. Eagles are just frustrating. They're just annoying. Unless you have Odie, then they're not annoying. It's just, but it's still a, a long battle, isn't it? I feel like I haven't spoken about Foran much, and Foran is a huge hero. I need to do a dedicated video on Foran. I, knew it did, I need to do a dedicated video on each hero, to be honest. So make sure you do subscribe, and uh, you can search through and find those videos. Okay, let's have a look to see Vif. Do you know what? Let's let's have a look at Finch's team a moment. What is he using? He's using Florabelle. Arden. Damien. This isn't... Yeah, see. I don't like this. I'm not facing this. This will be nasty. Um... You know what? Let's try it. Let's just see what happens. I want, I want to bring us floor about over and try and kill, but we're going to get warped by friggin' Iron. I, I, I can't see this working, but we're going to, I'm also going to bring in Smokey and uh, hope that we can heal through it initially, get Cecilia on for some roots and hope we can stop this floor about from bringing out all of our pets. Let's have a look. Well, Finch has got a lot of heroes, okay? A very, very high rarity. We've showcased him on this channel already. There comes the prisons. Oh, yeah, it's, it's just so much going on here with Iron. Um, did we get his Flora Bow even? One, two, three. We did kill his Flora Bow. Probably wasn't the one we should have focused on. Probably wasn't the one we should have focused on, but. We did. Let's see if we can find a number two, Maya, or Maya, not Ella. Ella again, Nisandra, Vif. Um, I don't think we fought Ars her. Let's have a look what Ars was running. 
Rainier, Vala, Rowan. This is similar to a team we did fight. Are we, am I sure we didn't fight this? Doesn't have Eagle. Let's just throw this team in. I feel like we fought this team. I feel like that's why it's set up. Ready for it. Or someone's just got the same team. Oh, Rainier died early on. What? Oh, was that us a seer getting pulled out? Valor's doing nothing, that's fine, but this is here with Mr. Carlisle could ruin us now. Foran had a good hit. A good hit. Our Cecilia is back. We're okay. We're okay. Uh, hopefully these battles have given you some sort of idea, okay? Some sort of idea. Um to counter some of those teams that are frustrating because they are. They are frustrating. Defenses. Again, this is tricky, and for some reason it feels very buggy. I will set my defences, and they sort of move around. Let me show you an example. Okay. Foran here with Rainier, uh, with Rowan, sorry. We're going to put Igor at the back so that he's always targeted by a Valor. Now, I'm going to go to this team, and I'm going to move this around. And just watch. What the hell? Do I have to do each one, then save, then switch, then save? But the trouble is, that's really frustrating. Like, look at this. What is that? That's not how I set it. So, which one did we just set? This one. But I feel like when you click save formation, it does it for every single one. So I'm going to click it for this one. And now, that's saved. I'm going to go to this team. And see what this one does. And I've got to wait a minute. But has it moved this? Yeah. Makes no sense. No sense whatsoever. What the hell? How can I set up a defense when it does that? I have no words. I have no words. I don't know what is going on with that. But maybe it's just mine. I don't know. Um, so that's it for the arena video. Hopefully that's helped some of you. If not. Let me know what you want to see, what, you know, what kind of content you feel like I could have covered in that PvP video. I probably could have covered more heroes, I know, I know. Um, but I can only really show you exactly what I use personally. I mean, there are other heroes like um, the Assassins, uh, Sylvina, who will go back to the enemy's line, right back to the enemy's line. And you'll have the, the sword on them. Let's just quickly show an example of that. You can see that the sword... Wherever you play Sylvina, she will switch her target on who she's targeting. So if you want to pinpoint someone down, then that can also be achieved. Um, I don't know if Marilee is going to be any good. Hewin is also a very good healer. So it really is limited to what you have in your roster. Maybe we'll do another video on PvP depending on how the feedback is on this one. So I'll see all of you in the next video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment below to help this channel grow. Have a fantastic day even wherever you are. Goodbye. <laughs>